What to expect when you have a bone marrow test. Your bone marrow is the spongy substance in the centre of the bones where the blood cells are made. You may have a bone marrow test if you have a cancer which affects the bone marrow, such as leukaemia, lymphoma or myeloma. If your doctor thinks your bone marrow may contain cancer cells that have spread from another type of cancer, or for some non-cancerous conditions. There are two types of tests, a bone marrow aspiration, which takes some bone marrow cells, and a bone marrow biopsy, which takes samples of the bone marrow and gives more information about its structure. Usually, your doctor takes a sample from the back of your hip bone, but you can have a bone marrow aspiration from your breast bone. You have the test lying on a couch. You may have a sedative beforehand to make you sleepy. Your doctor then injects some local anaesthetic to numb the area. For a bone marrow aspiration, they put a needle through your skin and into your bone. Then, using a syringe, they draw out some liquid bone marrow. You may feel a pulling sensation as they do this. For a biopsy, your doctor uses a slightly bigger needle to take the sample of bone marrow. They turn and push this needle to get the sample. This can be painful as the needle goes in, but it doesn't last for long. You usually go home about half an hour after the test. If you had sedation, you need to wait until you are fully awake, and this can take a few hours. Afterwards, your hip will ache for a few days. Taking painkillers helps. You may also have some bruising. Rarely, you may have slight bleeding from the site. Press on it if you do, and if it doesn't stop, contact the hospital. There is a small risk of infection. Tell your doctor if you have a temperature or the biopsy area becomes red and sore. You may have some tingling in your leg, which will wear off with time.